There are also questions over where new vaccination sites are going, particularly in Manatee and Sarasota counties, where some have opened up in the wealthiest neighborhoods. 10 Tampa Bay's Liz Crawford asked the governor why that's happening. As the governor travels the state pushing his seniors first vaccination plan, many are asking how he's picking and choosing pop up locations. At a 55 plus golf community in Brooksville Wednesday, DeSantis said this. Hernando County, uh, as of uh, earlier this week, I uh, was in the bottom five uh, of percentages of seniors that have been vaccinated in the state of Florida. So we said we're going to do something about it. When asked about including vaccine sites in communities so done, of color. Uh, we, we've typically done those through the churches and basically we'll partner with churches and we'll say sign up as many of your parishioners as you want. Uh, we'll do it and then you come in and knock it out and they've done between 500 to 1000 a day on those. However, not everyone buys that answer. U.S. Representative Charlie Crist. South St. Petersburg has plenty of senior citizens. Most of them are black. So there's one you can go to a pop up in. that's not going to be, you know, uh, Lily White, if you will. I mean, I don't know how else to put it. What is your response to Congressman Chris calling on the Department of Justice to investigate how you're picking these pop up sites? There's some people who are more upset at me for vaccinating seniors than they are for other governors whose policies have killed seniors. Florida's governor was criticized last week for placing a pop up vaccination site in a mostly white and wealthy neighborhood in Manatee County. A county commissioner is taking most of the blame, but some are asking what the governor knew and when did he know it? He's the governor. He should know. He should have known that the optics of this look terrible. 